Now from your exclusive home for minor league baseball, MLB The Show is on the air. Tonight, the first of this quick two-game series between the Pawtucket Red Sox and the Scranton Wilkesbury Rail Riders. It's baseball. It's the show. And it comes your way next. Babe Ruth gets his first opportunity now in the top of the first with nobody on. Ruth. Popped high in the air. Jimenez is there for it. And the inning is over. So a fairly painless top of the first. So it's on to the bottom of inning number one. No score. Babe Ruth will stand in here with a runner at first to start the inning. Now I know both of you are more familiar with the art of hitting as opposed to the art of pitching, but on a wet night like this, who do you think this favors? Well, I, I think it favors the pitcher. I, I know they're going to argue well the grip, but the ball doesn't carry on wet nights. So if I'm out there, I'm saying, look, pitcher advantage. I think a little unlucky there, maybe even more than a little unlucky. This ball's just absolutely scalded, but right at the third baseman on one hop, so he can autograph the ball before getting that double play started, and he'll roll it up easy, 5-4-3. Babe Ruth will stand in for the third time now, still without a hit, so that streak could be in a bit of jeopardy. And I think that's in the back of his mind, but it's not something he's really focused on. He just wants to get up there and put a good swing on the ball. Hit pretty well out to deep left field. Garlobo ranging back, but he won't get there as it lands just shy of the wall. The runner from second crosses the plate. That makes it a 4-0 ball game. Well, that hit extends his streak to lucky number 13 now. That's almost two full weeks where he's been swinging it. Now here comes the skipper out of the first base dugout heading for the mound. And it looks as though that's going to be all for his starter here tonight. Yvonne Nova is going to take over here in inning number five as it's going to be up to their bullpen to try and keep him in the game here. Standing in now, Jermaine Wiseman. Now a curveball that misses here to the cleanup man. It's 1-0. Oh, he wanted that one. Probably should have got it, too. Second and third, two away. Hey, let her fly, let her fly. Seared down the first baseline, but a foul ball, 1-1. One and one. Hey, you got it. No one better. Let's go. Fastball Ball close, but he didn't get it. Two and one. Hey, let's like jam, let's like jam. And he comes back with a pitch right down the middle for strike two. And that's about where he'll sit with that fastball. 93, let's 94. One time. And that's plenty hard enough to blow it by guys when you need to. He Three. got him. And exhale as he's out of the jam and the inning is over. So one run on four hits here. No errors and a couple of men left. Hey, plays the one. Here we go. Leading off the inning, Mason Williams. They'll need him to get something going here. Now to the plate, Babe Ruth. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Here comes the first pitch. Hit hard towards second, but he gets back in time safe at second base. Now batting, center fielder. Jermaine, Jermaine Wiseman, Wiseman will dig I'll in. Took ahead. a cold third strike his last time. Babe Ruth comes to the plate Look looking to deliver with the bases hey, loaded and two men gone. Well, these are those situations that kids go through in the backyard. Come on, baby. One bases time. Here juiced, we go. two outs. 
He needs to stay within himself and just focus on making good contact. And this is going to find the alley as he might have himself his Make second turn, double look, 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 in the ball game. Two run score. And a wide throw as this one gets hey. by him at the bag. In to score is the runner from first. It's a 7-2 ball game. Now batting, center fielder, Jeremy Weiser. So with a lefty waiting, they'll go to a lefty of their own out of the bullpen here. Now the runner breaks for the plate. That's taken for a strike. And a ridiculous way to end the inning. Not sure if he thought he could steal home or what, but it's an easy tag for out number three. A handful of fine individual performances to choose from in this one, boys. But what do you say we go ahead and let this man take home the hardware? He's our tops player of the game. Yeah, he was definitely a big part of this victory. You see there, four RBIs for him in the ball game. He came through when they needed him to, and he was instrumental in the win. So that just about does it. For EK, Psycho, and the crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, get those smartphones and tablets out and head over to the show nation. And we're back. The show's continuing coverage of minor league baseball is on the air. Today, the finale of this quick two-game series between the Pawtucket Red Sox and the scranton Wilkesbury Rail Riders. And with that, here's a look at the visitors' starting lineup. Babe Ruth will get his first shot here. Two hits in five trips a night ago. Well, you look at the average on the season, guys, and he's not sneaking up on anybody. Pretty amazing numbers for him right there. So yesterday's performance, obviously no fluke. Popped up. Romine has a play. And that ends the inning. Nothing doing here in the opening half inning. So it's on to the bottom of inning number one. No score. Babe Ruth in now. Popped out in his first trip. Yeah, he just uppercut a fastball. That top hand kind of dragged through the zone, which caused the bat head to drop a little bit. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Hey, I need you right here, one time. And that's inside. inside off the plate with the fastball. It's one and one. Not much to shout about for either team here as we start the fourth inning. Nothing, nothing. Yeah, I think we kind of knew that pitching might take the upper hand here. Maybe not to this extent, but both guys have really... Babe Ruth will stand in for the third time now, still without a hit, so that streak could be in a bit of jeopardy. And I think that's in the back of something he's really focused on. He just wants to get up there and put a good swing on the ball. A softly hit ball here, foul off to the left side, and it's strike two now. Come on, big Into pitch. the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. And Whoa, did he square around? No, it's hey, ball one. Up, Pretty huh? clear the plan is to keep everything away. And that's smart for most guys. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. Make it six shutout innings as he continues to give them fits out there. Babe Ruth will be tasked now with leading things off in their half of the night as they'll try to do something to prevent being shut out. And whatever they've done for the first eight innings hasn't yielded a whole lot so far. So, quite frankly, I'm not expecting too much. And we kick off the ninth inning with a swinging strike here. Nothing in one. Oh, and he leaves the fastball up there. Mistake in location. He is going to pay for it dearly as that ball is sent over the wall. A home run. A solo shot. Well, you always hope to get a good outing from your starting pitcher, but this man went above and beyond in this one. He's our top player of the game. Yeah, a real good performance, as you'll see in his final line. 
He gave him seven and two thirds good innings and he was definitely the difference in this one. So that's a wrap here this afternoon for EK Psycho and the rest of our crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, log on to the shownation.com. Scranton Wilkesbury comes out victorious, two to one. So long, everybody. For the